What's going on YouTube? A Soprano here bringing you guys a Black Ops 1 gameplay. What? Black Ops 1? What the hell? Well, I did say I was going to bring back some old Call of Duties into my channel. And guess what? I'm doing it right now. Bringing you guys actually an old gameplay. Because this is not a fresh gameplay. Uh, this is something that was in my vault. And I think this might have been my best gameplay out of, out of everything in Black Ops 1. I might have got something better, but I just didn't save it or it didn't save or whatever. Um, yeah, using the Galil with the silencer. Uh, fast mag, well not fast mag, Sil sleight of hand, I think I was using ghost at the time too, um, and I think I was using either hacker, I, I had to be using hacker, uh, and think that was it, uh, I don't know what my second secondary was, it might be like a pistol or something that I wasn't even going to use, I ended up switching it out later on, and yeah, playing on the uh, map firing range, what you guys know now is studio, but looking back at this map, looking back at the game the game mode I was playing, I was playing a Hardcore Headquarters. I totally forgot about hard, Hardcore Headquarters. I had a fit when they took it out of Hardcore because this was a game I only loved playing. The game that helped me level up the fastest, got the highest kills, and it was pretty epic. Playing with some friends too, some old, old friends that I probably don't even play with now. Um, actually, the only name I remember was Diplomats. That was one of my main guys. His name was Diplomats. He was basically my best friend on here he helped me out when I wanted to do the pro perk glitch and he helped me out with that he actually taught me how to do it and it was pretty pretty awesome as soon as I got money from my perks when I prestiged you know I hit him up and we basically uh, joined the party and he helped me do the glitch so I guess you could call me a glitcher or whatever but yeah this this uh, game mode brings back memories because I, I always you know forgot why did I play hardcore and I when I went back into core earlier today and i was playing i was like man i i see why i was playing hardcore all the time because when i run into two three people it's not like black ops 2 where you could clear out the team real quick or you know get some double kills and you know kill feeds and whatnot here it's a lot tougher because uh the damage on the bullets isn't a lot and that's probably why i went into hardcore and obviously my gun skill wasn't there so if the gun skill wasn't there the bullets wasn't cutting it it's like hardcore is the best place to go i could clear out a whole team with one mag and be cool with it and get like you know my kill streaks and right here you know headquarters just reminds me so much of a uh, hard point you know it's our, obviously hard point is a little bit different because you're going into the hard point protecting it and getting points while you're in it hard, uh, headquarters you go in you capture the headquarters and then like you start controlling it everybody dies and then the, the headquarters starts over again once they clear it out but here I'm playing headquarters like I would play hard point basically and I didn't even, I mean, I didn't even know what the hell Hardpoint was back in the day. And uh, I'm playing it just to get the kills because I know the team I was playing with, I know they they like playing the objective, so I knew they were going to take care of that. I was just going around, I guess you could say spawn trapping, some a little bit of camp, uh, getting a little campy and whatnot. But uh, getting my kills, I got two sets of dogs, uh, three sets of, uh, what is it, chopper gunner or, or airstrike or whatever it's called. It's a seven kill streak where you get the helicopter. And I got, uh, I think that was at the VSAT or the, well, I don't even know what the hell it was called, Blackbird. But they have another name for it, R871 inbound. I was playing that earlier. I was like, what the hell is the R871? And my nephew was like, that's a Blackbird. It's like, oh, fuck. How did you get a Blackbird? And I just started raging. But, yeah. The other thing, too, is that you notice that after, um, after watching myself play, I noticed that I changed a lot as a player. Uh, and then when I started making my classes, you know, I was looking it's like why the hell do I have this class? Like why the hell do I have this attachment? Why am I using Warlord when I could use Commando with Fast Mag, take off sleight of hand, put Steady Aim, put Scavenger, forget Ghost, and then put Marathon. And then <laughs> basically like all the classes that I had before are completely changed. The guns are the same. Maybe I still use the Galil. But, you know, just the attachments and the perks are different because I've grown as a player and I could just see that now by watching me play this game right here and, then, you know, when I created my classes. But hopefully you guys enjoy this. Uh, I'm going to try and bring Modern Warfare 3 on Mondays, Black Ops 1 on Thursdays. 
uh, and then everything else on the you know during the rest of the week uh, I'm gonna try and keep Black Ops 2 Tuesday and Wednesday and then bring some FIFA on Friday so have a pretty good set schedule it's not official it's not written in stone yet but uh, I have something ready for you guys I know this is this video is for Thursday tomorrow you're gonna are gonna see FIFA it's episode 4 but it's not my fourth match basically because some of the matches were boring but I'll talk about that more tomorrow hopefully you guys like this video don't forget to check out the trailer for the new zombies DLC and yeah don't forget to leave a like peace